Good morning and welcome to SI Live's AIM with Alex. I'm Alex Salmeri. It's Tuesday, we have a warm day ahead of us. Here are today's top headlines. With the first day of school approaching, many parents still have questions. The New York City Department of Education is hosting three additional information sessions for students and families citywide before the start of the new school year. The next virtual information session will be held on Thursday to answer any questions or concerns families may have. The DOE will be convening community and advocate roundtable meetings, briefings with elected officials and community education council leaders, and more. And a reminder that the first day of school in New York City is tentatively scheduled for September 10th. In other news, even with the world on hold during the coronavirus pandemic, this Arden Height resident was dedicated to training his students at the Training Institute for Medical Emergencies and Rescue. Monty Posner, executive director of the Institute, explained the many challenges he faced while training soon-to-be EMTs in the middle of a pandemic. Aside from teaching remotely and having to cut class size, Posner contracted the virus at his day job located at the COVID-19 testing center in Ocean Breeze. To learn more about his story, check out Posner's video interview that's live on our website now. And to end the show on a positive note, Staten Island resident Julia Gargano, a finalist in the latest season of American Idol, is officially assigned singer-songwriter. The Westerly resident announced Friday that she will be releasing original music under the record label 19 Recordings. The company has previously signed many other stars that have idol ties. On a social media post, Gargano wrote, All of my life I've dreamt of this. To see it becoming reality is unlike any feeling I've known. Let's do this. To find out more about all of these stories, visit silive.com. Thank you so much for tuning in. Remember, if you go out, practice social distancing, wear your mask, stay safe, and stay tuned for more updates.